Joseph Butker set to kick off. Here we go in a rematch of Super Bowl 48. The Seahawks and Broncos are underway. Oh, we, oh yeah, that's right. That'll be taken about a yard deep. And ultimately cannot get this out to the 25-yard line as he's dropped at the 23. 23-yard line. Give him 10 yards on the pickup, and it'll be second and very short. Extra bulk up front for second and inches. Three tight ends. Now a carry for Sanders. And some space here. And he slips up past the 45 before being tackled. 15 yards on the play, first down. That's a nice run right there, able to get to the outside. And so many times defenses say, okay, we've got you hemmed in. But if you're running the football, at least you know where everyone is coming from. You don't have to worry about the backside at all. That allows you to run with a little bit more confidence as you traverse down the field. And he's up across midfield and down into Seattle territory. He'll get a nice chunk there on the first down run, and it's second and four. It's a pickup of six. Brings up second and four. On second down now, it's James. Just a gain of a yard there, and now it'll be third down. And this is why aggressive defensive coordinators love to blitz. It wreaks havoc because they end up taking their attention to the blitzers, freed up the D lineman to make the play. Montana. And he's going to find his man out of the backfield. That's complete. Give him six yards, and they do convert on third. It's a gain of six. And the Broncos first down. They'll run on first down. It's James. And he'll take it into the end zone for the Denver score. Touchdown. Edger and James. 40 yards. And the Broncos have taken the early lead. So they start this game just like they won. Opening drive, touchdown, a nice run there to finish it off. Yeah, that's what we call an explosive run because of the distance. And being able to do that, that puts a little uncertainty in the minds of your opponent. Following the touchdown, here's Anderson to kick it away. And that one will bounce out of the back of the end zone, so we will start here at the 25. Wilson and the Seahawks take over now, first and 10 at their 25-yard line. The first carry for the legend is Bo Jackson, and he'll be upended at the 28-yard line. Just a three-yard gain there. He was brought down. Give him three on first down. It'll set up a second and seven. Second and seven. Out of the gun, here's Wilson. Throw right side is hauled in by the tight end, Gonzalez. And he takes it all the way down to the 32. Yeah. Running their plays over and over during the week can often get robotic for an offense, but on game day they can often flow smoothly, as that one just did. On first and 10, it's Wilson. He'll get the first down and more inside the 20. And he's all the way down to the 13-yard line. He's been a one-man wrecking crew these last couple of plays. This time, 18 more and a first down. From the 13 now, they work on first and 10. They run with Jackson out of the gun. And power running here down to the six-yard line. The ball carry. A solid run on first down. Gain of seven leaves him with a second and three. That run right there was an offensive line coach's dream, wasn't it? Guys picked up all their assignments, created a nice gap for the running back to get through. Pick up seven yards. Yeah, he's probably chortling on the headset right now, saying, we got it going, boy. Oh, it'll be intercepted. Picked off by Nandi Asamoa. And he will be brought down, but he's got the interception. On Man, that was fast, Nandi. Didn't know you had it in you. After one, seven, nothing on EA Sports. Broncos seven, Seahawks nothing. 